Hello angels! So, I am currently doing a reading vlog for the Poppy War, if you guys can't tell. Angels, I heard it's really good. I feel like I'm going to be obsessed and I want to vlog my whole experience because I heard it's really sad. And I've been reading it at work, that's why I haven't been vlogging as much for the first day. But holy crap, I am getting so hooked into it, angels. Like, I'm not even done yet with the first chapter, sadly. It's like long chapters and it's a really thick book. So I'm kind of in investing <laughs> my time into this book a lot and you angels will be watching it as well so yes the poppy war trilogy i am reading the first book right now so i am this far into the book not even a dent i had to go back and tab it as well it's like only <laughs> 15 pages i'm in i want to say it is so good so far it's a good sci-fi slash fantasy type of thing and it's actually really good so far like i'm already hooked into it it's just taking me a little bit longer to read each page because the font has so much words. Like, let me show you. Like, look at the font, angels. Look at the font. Like, I already tab. I need to go back and tab it, actually. There's also a map. Like, <laughs> it's so small. My hands are shaking, and it's so thin. So it's, like, extra floppy. <laughs> also, sneak peek. Don't look. But yes, this is the author R.F. Kuang. It is a female which is really cool. So yes, I cannot wait to continue reading this. Angels. Yes, the poppy war. I only read like 30 pages. And then today at work, I read like another 12 pages-ish. I realized too, I never explained what the book is about. So let me go ahead and read, like let you angels know. Because I feel like a lot of people know what this series is. But for people who don't and who are new to reading and whatnot and watch these older videos, I'm, I'm gonna let you know. Okay. So, basically, peasant, student, soldier, goddess. When war orf orphan, <laughs> orphan Rin acted the keiju, the empire-wide tests to find the most talented youth to learn at the academics. She surprised everyone, test officials, the guardians who wanted to marry her off and further their criminal enterprise, and even herself. But being a dark-skinned peasant girl from the south is not easy as St. Sangard, the most elite military school in Nikon. Nikon. I cannot pronounce these words. I probably should have looked up before describing this book, but work with me here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Targeted by rival classmates for her color, poverty, and gender, Ren discovers that gods long thought dead are very much alive and that she possesses a lethal, unearthly power. An appetite for the nearly mythical art of shamanism that can be the weapon the Empire desperately needs. While Nikara is at peace, its enemy and former occupies. <laughs> this is so unesthetic, I'm so sorry. The Federation of Mugen bides its time, and a third poppy war is just a spark away. Rin's shamanic powers may be the only way to save her people. Yet as she discovers more about the god that has chosen her, the vengeful phoenix, she fears the winning the war might cost her humanity, and it may already be too late. So yes, this is a sci-fi fantasy type of book. It is really popular. Um, I know it has like a good like four rating stars. I feel like I'm going to give it a five star just because like look at how much I've already tabbed and learning so much about the world so far. It's not really like building world building like a lot a lot right now. Like it's taking it bit by bit and I enjoy that because I'm not getting bored by it at all and I'm learning about Rin and all these other characters like her past so I'm really enjoying it like the first chapter is so long but it is so worth it ignore that that's to protect my books <laughs> I'm realizing now but yeah and she had to cut her hair I was like oh and when they described her I was like wait I didn't even know this because I like to go into books blindly so I never watched like other people's vlogs or anything or even read the synopsis until right now so I was like oh yeah she is a colored person I love that representation and she's from you know less you know she's in poverty she's like the poor you know um and so it's like kind of like a dystopian too like I love me a dystopian series like I grew up with the Hunger Games, the Maze Runner, and um, Divergent, and Percy Jackson too, I guess is kind of like dystopian in a way. So yes, and of course, um, Shadow and Bone Grishaverse is now my newest type of um, world building slash, um, where was I going with this? Dystopian, yes, type of way. So yes, I am excited to continue reading this more, but I got to only page 48 when 
I was reading at work. Uh, like I mentioned, the words are really small. So that's why too, I feel like it's going to take me a long while. But let's go ahead and read. I'm going to finish my lasagna and continue. Well, yeah, continue reading this book. I'm going to try not to stain it. Also too, if you guys want to know like my new tabbing system, let me know. Because like I've been tabbing a lot in this book. Like it is, it's so good. That's how you know it's going to be a good book is when I start tabbing it a lot. And trying to remember some things. That's why I love tabbing in a way. But yes, I'm going to continue reading this. <laughs> this book is hecking floppy. You, you, okay, look. Look, it's a brick, right? Chef's kiss. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, Angel's update is 9.35 p.m. And hold on, let me just use this for like lighting of some sort. And I sadly did not get that far. I'm trying to like, it's gonna fall. It's fine, it's fine. Um, okay, so the poppy word. It is getting so good right now. I'm stopping at a really good part. But like I mentioned, it's like 9.35 now. And I need to go to bed because I wake up at like, 5 30 in the morning to get ready to go to work and yeah i do not want to be sleepy whatsoever so yeah i'm stopping at page 82 um kind of a little mini dance kind of not but look look at my tabbing now angels you see that it's a bunch of tabs so far for just like 80 pages so yeah, I'm getting hooked into it. I'm taking it a bit slower because of the font. And I'm trying to comprehend everything that is going on with the world and the system and the history and everything. Which kind of sucks because I just want to speed through it. But I want to comprehend what I'm reading to enjoy the book more because I am enjoying it while taking time to digest all of this. So yeah, that's why I'm kind of reading it slow. Like I maybe read like 40-ish pages today maybe. <laughs> Usually I would read 100 pages a day, but that's usually more with fast paced books and like less world building. And I am starting a series, so, and it's a sci-fi fantasy, so of course it's going to be a lot of world building and etc. So yeah, but anyways, I will update you angels tomorrow once I am out of work because I would record myself reading at work, but it's kind of awkward to record at work, if you know what I mean so yeah that is it for today i had a good little reading session but now it is time for me to get some sleep i will see you angels real soon my hair's been doing this lately <laughs> it's gross but yeah i will see you angels soon <laughs>
and everyone treats her like crap and it makes me pissed off like i got so mad that there's so many red tabs in this book already usually i don't use a lot of my red tabs but i'm using a lot of my red tabs currently but yeah i'm gonna stop here today on page 112 can't wait for the weekend on saturday i will definitely be getting a lot of reading done and friday because someday i am going to go out with my friends so i definitely won't be reading on sunday so yeah maybe i'll go out to the park or something on sun saturday by myself or something and get like a lot of pages done in one week because this is definitely going to take me a week i'm predicting predicting it can't even speak english lately so yeah that was a little update i will see angel soon with another update angels it's like my downstairs neighbors were like coming on their bed their kids by the way they have two kids and i'm trying to sleep i wake up at like 5 a.m if i don't have Angels, I just got done recording something on my book talk and slash posted a video, a picture on my bookstagram because someone gifted me book fairy to me. It is from, I'm going to read you the note. It says, hi Seth, hope you enjoyed this book as much as I did at Matt's bookstagram from Madison Robbins. I know this has nothing to do with the poppy word vlog, but I just want to include it here anyways if she sees this video as well. And this is the book she got me. I have Lauren Asher's 30 year series book only i believe one and two i heard so many good things about this like i seen larissa isabel my favorite beauty people rave about this book and i'm so excited to eventually read it as well it is so pretty <laughs> i'm I, I may or may not put it on my bloomathon bingo card changing it we'll see but anyways yes i just want to include it here thank you thank you so so much madison go follow her as well like i said at um mad's bookstagram <laughs> i'm so happy like i love when people book carry me because it's so random i was like who sent me this is it another arc maybe but no, it was a book fairy. <laughs> so happy. Thank you so, so much. Anyways, let's go ahead and continue on with the puppy wear vlog. Sorry for this interruption. <laughs> okay, angels, it is like 8.36 p.m. And I finished part one. I'm going into part two, aka chapter 10. Um, That was a lot to take in a Rin from her self like i feel like this part is the background of our main character and everything and like the world building and the characters and the war and everything the gods learning it all and then now with this part i'm kind of scared because i kind of know probably what's gonna happen i'm nervous even though there's like two more other books i need to read and i got in a good chunk of it really good dense chunk and look at my tabs now, angels. Like, holy moly. It is getting so good. I love Rin's character. But she's kind of reminding me of this anime character. I do not want to say because I feel like it will be spoilers. But let's just say it's a really popular anime. And she's kind of making me think of that with, like, stuff. I don't want to spoil too much because this is a reading vlog for just the first book. And I do not want to spoil it. Um... So yeah, it is really good so far though. Like, ah, I'm gonna keep reading until maybe nine and then watch YouTube for like 30 minutes and then go to sleep because I work tomorrow, tomorrow's Friday. So yeah, today's St. Patrick's Day as well. I did not know. I'm not even wearing green right now. I'm wearing my PJ shirt. So yeah, but it is getting really interesting. It is definitely giving me five star vibes and I am enjoying it so, so much. So yeah, angels, I will see you real soon with another update. Okay, angels, it is the next day once again, even though I'm always vlogging in my PJ shirt 
I'm so sorry. I'm going to change my PJ shirt tomorrow, actually, because I usually keep it for like a week or so. But anyways, it is currently 8.28 and... <laughs> 823 where did i get 828 from <laughs> but anyways yes i'm going to sleep because sadly last minute i have to work tomorrow at 5 a.m to like 1 30 p.m which is like an eight hour shift and my boyfriend i will have to wait for him because he's working the same time 5 30 or 5 a.m to um 3 30 p.m sadly so in that meantime, I will be waiting for him at Barnes & Noble tomorrow, so we will get a different setting than here in my room in this PJ shirt. So yes, and so far I've gotten really good, really good stuff from the book. <laughs> God, like the title makes sense now, and I'm shook. Um, I'm on page 286. So I'm like a good chunk in about 50% done with the book. And like look at my tabs, like update on my tabs. <laughs> it's crazy. I love tabbing so, so much. It doesn't take a lot of time at all for me to tab personally. And I love tabbing. It's so much fun. And it's so pretty. So yeah, this book is getting really good. I am shook, excuse me, of what has happened so far. So, yeah, I don't know where the second book is going to go from now. Like, I know for sure I'll figure out once I'm, like, done with this first book. But even still, I don't know where this will take, you know? Who knows? But anyways, I will stop here for today, angels. And tomorrow, we will be at a new setting. And I am going to be working, <laughs> sadly, on my day off. I'm usually off Saturdays and Sundays. So, this sucks. But anyways, I will see you angels tomorrow. Okay, hello angels. It is the next day. I'm going to go Barnes and Noble. It's like I'm right. I'm, the, the building's right, right there. So, I'm going to go and read while I wait for my boyfriend. Like I mentioned before, I worked overtime today. I got out at 1.30. It's 1.38. And I'm waiting for him until he gets out at like 3.30. So, I'm going to go inside and read and browse around and maybe buy one book or a manga. We'll see. Look in my tote bag that says Stay Rad that my best friend, Bestie Ramala, gave me. So, yes, I'm going to go ahead and go read The Poppy War. Try and see there's there's no people around. But anyways, let's go inside. <laughs> Okay, I am back. Um, I recorded a few little bits and pieces of me reading there, but honestly, there are so many people coming, and I was trying to feel it's so busy. Like, why aren't y'all at home or working? But then I realized it is spring break, so that's why there is a bunch of people there. I was like, holy crap, no wonder why. But I did get a little bit of reading done. Where's the book? <laughs> I did get a little bit reading done with the poppy wear. Um, not too much. I only read like 20-ish pages or so. Just sitting there in a cafe and then- Oh! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh, y'all fell! Okay, hold on. It's okay. Okay, as I was saying before, my phone fell actually. Um, so I was reading like a few pages, 20-ish pages or so. And then some like kind of smelly weird guy that has really bad hygiene sat kind of near me and I can smell him and I just felt so bad and I just stayed there for as long as I can until eventually I just couldn't I am in my car right now I'm still waiting it is like 2 29 p.m I'm still waiting until my boyfriend gets out so I think I'm just going to go to Marshall's real quick to go look around see some shorts because I kind of need more shorts but I think that is it. I'm going to go to Marshall's and then 
I think that's all I'm gonna do and then go and wait in the parking lot for my boyfriend. There's some lady right next to me as I'm vlogging, but it is okay. Anyways, yes, that is a little update. I will see you angels real soon when I'm back at home, not surrounded by people because of my anxiety. <laughs> I get so nervous. And yes, I did indeed buy books, but I do not want to show you angels because that is going to be for a book haul. But just know I got them at the buy one get one 50% off table. The people there are so nice as well. Like I love the co-workers there. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead to Marshall's and once this lady leaves. Bye lady. <laughs> so awkward. Okay, angels, update. I'm done shopping. I bought some cute stuff, bought some stuff for plants that add to my bookshelf. Um I am still waiting for my boyfriend. It is 3.40 angels. Um, he's still not out. He's still trying to finish what he's trying to finish. So I am actually reading right now before he comes. So yes, I shall now be reading again because I need to finish this book soon for the blooming, blooming readathon angels. If you guys do not know angels, I am partaking the read bloomathon readathon by Ali, Allison, and Krista. Also known as Christy. So I am excited. I'm trying to finish this book. Like literally I have that. Hold on, I can get a better angle. Literally these much pages. I hate how the paper's so thin too. Like what is this? Bible paper. <laughs> but yes, I'm gonna try to finish it. Even though tomorrow I'm going to see my friends and we're gonna hang out. I'm gonna take this book with me if I don't finish it. I'm going to try to finish it. I will stay up hella late if I have to. So yeah. <laughs> And I would just sleep on the car going to with my friends and stuff and then bring a book with me. I don't know which book I'm going to bring, to be honest. I think I'm going to bring a book that I'm not going to tab. So, like, a thriller book, maybe? But anyways, I'm going to continue reading The Poppy War. it is still the same day i'm looking crusty um it is currently 8 44 <laughs> i just finished part two like now i'm going to start part three and like what the freak just happened like i kind of expected that to happen because why would they you know if you know you know <laughs> so this part honestly to like elaborate a little bit without no spoilers going into depths of where Rin is now at and she meets someone from the beginning of the story as well once again and holy crap <laughs> oh. well not only one person she also meets like another person actually and holy crap what the heck because I was not expecting that I mean I was in a way but kind of not but like look at I got that little bit left, just that little bit. Like, <laughs> I'm not ready to finish it now, even though I was complaining about how thick it is. Look at my tabs, y'all. Those are my tabs, angels. My tabs are really thick. <laughs> this book, so much happening in, you have to like invest your time with this book, I feel like, to digest everything, especially the parts, because holy crap, I feel like the parts as well are set in different places, even though in the first part one, it's set in multiple places. But you'll understand what I mean when you read it eventually. So, yeah, what the heck? Okay, time to finish this book because it is still the 19th, a day before the Bloomathon, readathon that I'm doing that is hosted by these people that I'm just now doing and doing it with a twist. So that video will probably be definitely up already actually i posted it today so this blog will hopefully be posted still centered around the bloomathon bloomin a thon bloomin readathon yeah so anyways yes i'm going to continue reading and try to finish this book because oh i don't know if i can finish it but i'm going to try like really try so i'll be back angels yo
I look crusty right now, like really crusty. Okay, but like, page, <laughs> page freaking 491 and 492 got me tearing up right now. <laughs> Teary eyed, what the fuck? Like, I am almost, I'm almost crying, but like, I'm just teary eyed. My heart, my heart. It's like 11.30 and I'm still not done with the book. I think I have like 30 pages left. <laughs> I'm trying to finish it, y'all. I really am. So then I can sleep. But yeah, what the fudge? <laughs> okay, anyways, I'm gonna continue reading. Angels, I finished the book. I am so tired. It is 12.27, so it's midnight. It is literally the Blumathon. I'm tired. I'm going to sleep. I've been awake since like 3.30 a.m. <laughs> Y'all, I need sleep. But I finished it. I finished it. Look at the tabs. To the very end. I'm going to give my full in-depth review tomorrow when I have everything settled in. And I'm more refreshed and energized because I am dead. I've never stayed up late to finish a book over like 100 pages actually. I'm tired. Okay, I'll see you angels <laughs> in the morning. Good morning angels. It is Bloomathon time. But first off, I had to wrap up this whole book vlog video and talk about the puppy war. I give this a 5 out of 5 stars after thinking about it last night and doing my makeup. That's why I look really presentable today um holy crap Rin's character chef's kiss she is flawed like she thinks she's better than anyone in the academy and stuff and i just love her character so so much she's an orphan and she's figuring out who she is during this time and everything happening in this book and i love the other characters and how they're introduced and they're not just side characters they're also like you know important to the story and to her and it's really good because i hate it when books try to have characters like in the golden couple i didn't like that book i gave it 3.5 stars but i want to use that example there's too many characters they're all intertwined but you don't really get to know about them that much i mean you do but not like in the way i would like as in like the poppy war and it's in more in depth that's why there is more than one book especially after what all happened in this first book was beautiful it was slow paced it was beautiful the world building wasn't that complicated we get to learn about the gods and everything and everyone and they're like i guess like you want to call it like factions and stuff but like it was so so good and you see where rin comes from and then we're gonna see her grow as a person because she like aged like maybe i think three years in this book and you get to see everything that these kids have been through and her and everyone around them and people like holy crap it was just a masterpiece i love it oh so so much i'm gonna tear up because i almost cried at the end i was tearing up if you angels didn't see that clip um because i started getting attached to one of the characters and i know for sure i shouldn't be getting attached to characters now i'm only gonna get attached to the main character and someone else i'm not going to spoil too too much but it was just so so amazing like look at my tabs angels it was beautiful i cannot wait to read the second one i feel like this whole series is gonna be five stars for me who knows i just there's nothing bad about it for me like i loved every single moment of it to be honest i think the only bad thing was when ren kind of lost her way in seeing things I think that was like the only bad thing <laughs> she kind of reminded me of a sasuke <laughs> if you know you know so yeah i give it five out of five stars angels so amazing please go read the series and yeah i will see you angels with, real soon with the second book and the vlog slash like now it's gonna be with the bloom readathon eee! anyways i gotta record my other video for the bloom Marathon angels um thank you all for watching this video go follow me on my other social media subscribe um all my social media is linked down below and everything and until next time angels have a good day good night morning whatever time it is when this video gets to you and stay safe and be healthy bye